Job number one, get the supplements in, B12, long chain omega-3 and glucosamine, all vegan of course. For those that know me, my first meal of the day is generally always a smoothie. Uh, I'm going to use a tablespoon of soya protein and rice protein. I have a can of pineapple in there for a change, just to mix things up. Hard to get ripe right pineapple in this country. Pre-workout smoothie, so beetroot's going in, boost my nitric oxide, a couple of bananas, some seaweed, a few greens, don't even know what ones they are for maple and coal. I'll have half a tablespoon of chia and flax seeds, and I'll have what you can only describe as a shit ton of dates. So, pre-workout smoothie, I'm going to get this down me. As I say, it's got plenty of nitric oxide from the beets, give me lots of uh, power for my workout. I'm meeting uh, my friend Emma Louisa today, aka Banana Warrior Princess of YouTube. I'll put her link in the description below, so check out her channel. And now uh, we're going to do a bit of a collabo, so it should be fun. So one of the local farms, our friend Mikey, his dad works there, and they were going to throw out this... Uh, a shit ton of veg. Um, so Mikey thought I know someone who will eat a lot of vegetables. So <laughs> Gemma and myself are the happy recipient of a load of peppers, a big load of kale, uh, spinach, a load of beets. What have we got here? Cucumbers, more peppers, lots and lots of carrots. There's some more stuff as well. So uh, lucky us. Good old Mikey. Thank you, Mikey. Okay, so now I'm going to make two identical smoothies to take to the gym with me, one post-workout, one for later on, and a proper meal in the evening. <laughs> so this smoothie is going to be the same uh, protein sources, soya, protein and rice. It's good to mix the gooms with uh, grains, the amino acids really complement each other. You get a good uh, all-round protein source. For my overt fats, got my hemp and chia seeds again. Uh, we accidentally left a load of frozen berries out of the freezer. So it looks like a ton of uh, black currants and um, blackberries. Sorry, is going in my next uh, smoothies. Uh, some of the uh, other spinach that my friend brought round, and uh, again, just a shed load of dates. Really, a good 300 plus grams, and show plenty of energy for the day. High carb for the win. Look at all this purple deliciousness. All the real deep, uh, vibrant colours really speak of uh, antioxidants and health. Which is nice. What do you say, mate? Oh, I'm here. Hello. Hi. Yeah, get get it down, yeah. Sweet. I'm off to the gym. Bye now. Bye now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get in there. So we're at Phoenix Gym today. I've got my friend Emma, Phoenix. aka Best Gym in Norwich, Best gym in Norwich Phoenix Gym O3. <laughs> uh, so this is Banana Warrior Princess on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, yeah. all that good stuff. Facebook. Check out her channel. She's really uh, taken off. Real nice girl. She is. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Now go for the slam, now. Don't forget Thank to like you. and subscribe. Ethics and ethics. Nice. Nice. Nine. 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 Nine.
Some plant based pecs. Plant based pecs. Plant based pecs. Plant based pecs. Keep up, women. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, you die if you're protein deficient. So, yeah, we're like unfortunately, I can't hear you, Emma, because I'm dead. <laughs> like in that film, uh, what's it called? Dumb and Dumber. No. <laughs> I know, no, that's just people who think you. So that's my philosophy. I train with the HIT style, high intensity training made popular by Mike Mentzer, Dorian Yates. So I'll do a couple of compounds, as heavy as I can every week, trying to smash the weights up. The last compound, I'll do a couple of four steps, something like that, to really beat the muscles into submission. Finish with a couple of isolation moves. Triple drop set on the last isolation, just rinse every single last bit of the strength out of your muscles. There'll be not in a good way. I was going to swear then. They'll be not good <laughs> no for a week. On my no swearing <laughs> on your blog. They'll be uh, your muscles will be sore for a week, but next week they'll be recovered as long as your nutrition is good. Nice uh, whole foods vegan diet. Smashing in the carbs. Yeah, I train on about 1,200 grams of carbohydrate. I show 500 grams of animal protein. Now 160 grams of plant protein, over a kilo of, of carbs. Little fats, nuts, you know, um, flax seeds, chia seeds, get the mega freeze. Uh, yeah, but uh, do you feel like you recover better now that you're yeah, much the better, vegan? better recovery, better sleep. My eyesight is twice as good. I don't get hay fever, I don't get tendonitis. I'm flying, plant based for the win, baby. Be gainism. <laughs> so, would you stop doing that to me? Emma? <laughs> Last set of the day, <clears throat> no pressure, but everyone's watching you. <laughs> Very Yep. Four. Five. 
That's the end of our <laughs> hello. <laughs> That's the end of our video. If you've enjoyed this episode, like and subscribe. You know it, and we'll see you next time. We'll see you next time. Bye. Vegan for the animals. Bye. We'll duff you up. <laughs> So I nearly forgot to tell you about my dinner. Uh, I've eaten half of it already, so imagine there's twice as much of this. What have we got in here? Like a chickpea korma with cashew nuts, Jim? Yeah. Jasmine rice. We've got some kale on the go as well, which I'll have with some nooch. And what's in this uh, juice, Jim? Beetroot, celery, cucumber, carrot. Do you want to sign off for me, Jim, being here on the camera? Beans, I've got my mouth on. Yeah. Um, <laughs> You'd like that, wouldn't you? <laughs> If you've enjoyed Paul's video, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Yeah, come on, like and subscribe. Come on, help us out. Bye. <laughs> I'm nobby. <laughs> <laughs>